Um, oh, that is way better. Since I closed the door, this one door is, is what it is. What's going on, YouTube? It is your boy Pooski, and we are back with another video. We are about to go bowling. I have not been bowling I don't know how long. It's been a minute. And we're going to try to knock out some videos. We're going to try. And I, I want to try a little bit of a different video. And I think I'm going to start doing this. Uh, because, um, if you can't tell, with the PBA content, I just was was not feeling it for real for real i just stopped honestly uh so we're gonna try something different because i'd be watching like swole crannon uh russell like workout bodybuilder type vlogs and people and what they do is just like they go about their day and vlog throughout the day and then they work out and show you how they work out so why not me do it the opposite way and well not opposite but Instead of working out, I'm bowling, and I'm still vlogging throughout my day, even though today is just going to be quite simple. So, y'all will see what I mean. But, yeah, why not? I just want to test it out, see how it is. So, yeah, let's go ahead and get into it. Let's just go ahead and get into it. Oh, shit. Oh, wait. That's it. We find it out. Oh, that does work. Wow, that works perfectly. And since this is a vlog, too, let's talk about what's going on when I'm going on in my life. Let's go. Let's talk about what's up. First of all, I'm loving these things. It's a cloudy day, so I can't really put them on. There's no use in putting them on. I don't want to be that dude that rides around with shades on. I mean, but I have about this is my third pair of 100%. These are 100% uh, glasses. Not sure if you can see. Yeah, you can see that. And these are the Money Mike editions with the gold that is. Oh my God, that gold is fire. And let me tell you, bro, I have the, I just got the Fernando Tatis's, uh it's limited edition. Now I got the Money Mics. I found these on TikTok. Uh, not the TikTok shop, but somebody uh, had them at his shop and posted a TikTok about it and said, oh, there's a few more left. And if you want to come get it. So I went and got it. Um, and they just got here yesterday. And then I got the Glendales. These are the Speedcrafts. And then the other ones are S3s. I'm a collector now. I, I love these. I love these things. I'm not going to lie. And of course, I got my little insert for my glasses so I can see through them. So, all good. But what I want to talk about is freaking Love Island. Because I have been watching Love Island like crazy lately. Like, that is my show and tonight i might just record my reaction because tonight's gonna be a wild episode is part two of movie night and we're gonna see some bs i seen the preview and they talking about aaron and kayla and kayla cries every freaking episode and she's crying a whole bunch which i mean this time i understand with this whole situation and then there might be leah and rob part freaking 58 of their whole saga who even though I thought Rob was actually going to go to Liv, which that whole thing, even though Liv, I think Liv is a little, I don't, I don't know. Because she pays attention to girls more than she does to guys, and she barely talks to them. So, I don't know that whole situation. We'll just have to see what, what ends up with that. Um, and then we got Serena and Cordell. I mean, they're going to get back together. We all know, you know, the whole uh, diet, uh, day of situation. Even though I just seen a TikTok where they said, you know, uh, where she was like, oh, she doesn't care about OBJ and, you know, she actually likes Cordell for Cordell. But then somebody went back on OBJ's Instagram. I don't know how they searched it, but went through the comments and found her at and found that she commented some hard eyes under OBJ's post. But yeah, that's going to be an exciting episode tonight. Can't wait to watch that. Uh, and can't wait to bowl because I'm a 
throw my new bone balls. I hopefully I hopefully the lanes ain't too crazy that I can do a video for the 78U urethane and the Venom Shock and get a little bit of practice and might work on spares. New spare ball coming soon. And then we're still waiting on the EJ Tackett uh, motor ball. Not sure if we're gonna be able to get it. It is what it is. But like I told him, I for sure want my new spare ball. And that's the clear white, um, just like my gold uh, Belmo ball. Uh, I, I want that spare ball because it's not Belmo and it's not gold. I want that one because they had the little miniature thing and I knew it was like a preview of something to come soon and now they finally got the spare ball out and I need it let's go ahead get on this road uh, and uh, go let's go bowling Not, let's go golfing let's go bowling Listen, listen, that's Montana. If you don't know about Montana of 300, you're missing. Well, I'm going to say you missed out because yeah, you, you missed the prime. Because I was seeing the TikTok and they were like, if you were in high school and you were not bumping Montana of 300 in the prime Montana of 300 days, you were missing out. And it is the truest statement of all freaking time because if you know anything about montana 300 between 2000 i don't want to get it wrong but i graduated in 2017 so like around there like 2015 16 17 that whole era and if i would say 2019 2020 bro that montana 300 was different i mean you had Chirac, you had the remixes his white iverson his uh holy ghost which was bars and of course everybody knows his uh effort brains out and wife and you man his bars and i thought he like stopped music because his last song on apple music is from almost a month now almost a whole year uh july of last year that he actually put out a single but he still does remixes because this is a not like us which i've been listening to uh not like us remix and a few other songs so i thought my bro just fell off the face of the earth but no he's still putting out remixes so yeah i'm gonna be bumping my boy let's go that's that's wild <laughs> That's that's why I didn't even plan that. That's that wasn't even planned. How I was talking, that 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 just happened. Oh my god! Oh my last time I put these on, these feel like brand new shoes, honestly. Oh, we love it, boy. We love it.
I don't know what just got into me bowling wise. I don't know if it was because my boy CJ, shout out to CJ, of course y'all know I'm bowling at my favorite, well, in my hometown, home bowling alley, uh, East of Shore Lanes. Uh, CJ, he put my name as Tanjiro, or if it was because I haven't bowled in so long, but I just bowled my ass off. Like, the first game, of course, the first game, whenever I bowl by myself, I always take it as practice, not going too hard. Just loosen up my body here. It was like a 170 something. And then the next game was a 279. Then the next game was a 278. Then I finished off with a 222. A 222. Like, brother, I, I'm utterly confused right now. And utterly, like, speechless. Because I haven't bowled this good in. God knows how long. Okay, my door is open and it's raining, so. Yo, this is crazy. This is crazy. And y'all just seen it. Like, I was stroking the people that were beside me and around. They were just like, yo. Like, yo, keep it going. Like, and I was like, I'm trying, but I'm tired also. And it's all, and that's one thing that I like doing when I bowl by myself is to keep going because it builds endurance and builds up your strength and all this stuff because I'm lifting a 15 pound bowling ball each and every time to wipe it off to bowl with it and you know you got to get used to that you know especially if you want to do PBA tournaments and you want to do tournaments in general because you're going to be doing that at least I mean I know the one tournament up in uh, Delaware uh, that's like four games uh, and then you got bracket play um for pba tournaments sometimes it's like eight games a session and then you bowl multiple times a day um and or you might just do six games and then another six games later like so you need to build up that endurance and that um stamina uh when it comes to bowling because it's a physical sport i mean i'm sweating like crazy i know i'm probably just like glowing but like ha huh, man that's crazy that I bowled so good. Now I gotta go get gas and I have to get something to drink because I drink all my agua. Uh, so I'll probably just go get me a, a gold peak tea, of course. I'm speechless. Oh, oh, well, well, I got y'all here. I gotta say this to my woman crush. One day I will meet you, one day soon. The great Koi, Croy Bethune. That plays for the Washington Spirit. She turned me into a Washington Spirits fan. I started watching NSWL. After Premier League, I'm just dead to soccer. I'm not going to lie. Or English football, what have you. But she got me into it. Some summer stuff, okay? She got me into it. And, and I mean, this girl, I mean, this woman is a beast. I mean, rookie of the month. I mean... Like, she's like a top assister on the team, top goal getter. I mean, she she's remarkable, and she's gorgeous. I mean, God. Yes. Whew. Mm. All right, let me go ahead and let me go ahead and um get me something to drink. Yeah, because I'm sounding real thirsty, and I? It is what it is. I don't really care. Because it's me. Thirsty. These glasses. Oh, my God. Everybody in the club, make it loud.